How's it going? How's it going? Huh? How's it going? What you doing? Hey, hey, hey. No, 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 no. Are you fixing stuff? Are you fixing stuff? Yeah? Are you fixing stuff? <laughs> Look at your beak. <laughs> I'm pretty much done with the jackets because the season is kind of sure. over. So, yeah, those ones don't um, have any crap in mine. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. Um, I'm gonna pass on a flute on this BB. This I gotta pass. Okay. This I will be interested, even though that this doesn't work for mm -hmm. parts. Yeah, it's, because it's, it's vintage. vintage. It's 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 a cool piece. Yeah. Um, the couple cards here. And the, just, and the this, jacket. This is my set. Yeah. I mean, what are you thinking? What do you want to get out of I this? I don't. Stuff? I mean, I don't know. I've lost my job and I'm trying to support my kids. So if you can do the best you possibly can, I get it. But that's I mean, why I'm doing this. This is this is older jacket as well, but it's got nice embroidery on the back. Mm -hmm. But it's it like is ladies, warm. so it's not like it. This stuff flies out of my shop here. Okay. Um, I'll do fifty bucks for everything. For the jacket, the rifle. And these three cards. For all of it? Basically 20, 20, and 10 bucks. <sighs> all right, I'll do it. Okay. I, I just, yeah, I know. Broken. I just thought that was me worth more. It's a this is broken. If I get 40 bucks out of it, they'll I, be like, okay. you know, mm -hmm. these are just a few bucks. And this maybe he's not interested. No, no. Okay, how come? I got Just probably 15 or 20 of them in there, okay. so it's supply and demand. No problem. I gotta pass Is there another there. trading post maybe? or? Uh, there is another shop down the street, but he doesn't buy stuff like this. He mainly buys tools and electronics. Uh, okay. You can try. Okay. You can try. Uh, I will need your ID though, so I can mm -hmm. make sure. sure. Like I said, with coats, I'm kind of yeah, done. Seasonal. It's Yeah, okay. 20, 40, 50. Beach. That's your copy, okay? Nice doing business with ya. Don't forget your stuff, let me give you a bag. Thanks. Probably nice not, I got quite a few right now, so... I don't think that's gonna go in, in there. Okay. Oh, thanks. Okay. Thank you so Thank much. You. It was All really right. nice to meet you. Pleasure. We'll see you soon. Thank you for helping me. I'm here by myself this morning. I mean, except Vicky is back there working on eBay, but I got buried. Uh, first hour, oh, hour and a half. It's been non-stop. I got stuff everywhere. Got a TV, got some tools, Blu-ray player, more tools, bunch of knives. <coughs> Ruby's screaming. Hello. <coughs> Why are you screaming, Rube? You gotta stop that. Come on. Always got something to say. Is that Ruby? That's Ruby. Okay, I just saw on your sign. I finally put two and two together. There right you go. Here, yeah. There. Yeah. Comfortable, honey? Comfortable? You're laying on my jacket. I'm going to show this jacket now. So I picked up this uh, vintage BB here. The name on it is Blue Streak. And it's made by the company called... Sheridan Production in Racine, Wisconsin, made in USA. The pump on it is shot, but the trigger still loads good. Yeah, at least I thought it was loading good. The pump on it is completely shot. The seals are blown inside, so, but still very, uh, very cool piece. So I paid, uh, I paid 25 bucks for this. Hopefully I can get maybe 60 70 dollars out of this one even for parts a bunch of little trains nothing special here a couple a couple cars this is actually a engine here 
And then I got this really nice vintage Harley Davidson ladies jacket that uh, Honey is laying on it. Can you move baby? See how nicely it's embroidered. The only downside to this is that this is XS, extra small. Um, overall in very good condition. Nice Harley label inside, but the leather is so soft and nice. So, and motorcycle season is about to start, probably another month or so. So this should be very relatively quick sale here in the shop. I don't know what I'm gonna price for it. Um, I also gave her 20 bucks for it. And then it came with the chap, chaps here, but they're made out of some weird letters, so stiff and unknown name. Are you comfortable? Yeah? So this was a really nice pickup. All right, this new setup throws me off a little bit here. So, so I have this new light here. Table is angled differently and I don't have a right platform yet for my camera, but very cool cell here. This is a Kodak camera with a bunch of accessories. And I mean like ton of accessories, but I just want to show you guys the camera. Very, very cool. Uh, ret Retina, it's called. Made in Germany, but it's a Kodak. Looks like this, comes with this beautiful leather case. And this thing pops out. Yeah, like that. And this slides out. This lens, just like that. Beautiful piece. And then it's attached on the bottom here. You can take it completely out of the case. And here's the crank on the bottom. Instead of being on top, like most cameras, this one has it on the bottom. Overall, great condition camera. We did pay it up because of all the accessories that, <coughs> that it came with, I'm sorry. And uh, paid 50 bucks for it, sold for $130. It didn't take long to sell at all, probably about two, three weeks. Uh, sold for 130 bucks, $20 shipping, and we paid 50. It's just a beautiful piece of, uh, of equipment from back in the day. This is a Retina 2C. I swear today is gonna be a knife day. Look at this uh, Cutco hunting knife. Like brand new, the blade is spectacular. This is model 5725. This is the one that it's called uh, K-Bar. This is the old school, because the new one comes in with the plastic sheet, not the leather sheet. So this is really nice. Um, Pay the guy $60 for this one. They can go as high as, as $150. bucks. Kind of all over the place, depending on the on condition of the blade. But this one is spectacular. And then look at this stiletto. Italian stiletto. Look at that. Ooh! Is that blade flying out or what? This is a company called N... N-E-X? Or... Yeah, it's hard to tell. So I'm like... Why is my music not playing? Turning this up, nothing's happening. And of course, Ruby just chopped the cables. What'd you do here? What's going on with you? Look what you did. You're horrible. Yeah. You're going back in a cage. Come on, step up, step up. You were such a pain in the butt. So I'm packing a bunch of orders for viewers here. Here's that American Eagle ceramic letter guide that it's going out to Bobby. Bobby, it's on its way. Patrick, these are... Uh, your vinyl is coming to you. And I want to say I'm sorry to Jared. Jared was messaging me back and forth today morning. And he wanted to buy this uh, uh, Wisconsin State Police hat from me. And as we are talking and agreeing on a price, this thing sold on eBay, Vicky listed yesterday. So Jared, I'm so sorry, I apologize. Hopefully I get another one. Uh, yeah, but this one is going, unfortunately, to somebody else though. So, thank you. Sometimes it happens like that. What are you gonna do, you know? I mean, I can't complain, it's sold either way, but yeah, Jared, if you see another one or if I get another one, I'll hit you up before we list. 
A lot of people want to know, and I think this is a very good question, and I've been asked this before many, many times, uh, but this question constantly pops up. Pete, what do you do if you get multiple orders like this one, meaning this person bought five different uh, trains from me, and he paid for everything, but he asked me kindly if I can reimburse some shipping on it, because each individual, you know, there was... This and this was together for sale. And then, you know, four of these trains were for sale and there are a couple of these, you know, and each had shipping like seven, 12, $14. Actually the shipping, the shipping came out here to be $58 for everything. And um, he's not too far away. He's actually in Illinois. So it's gonna be relatively cheap. This whole box, I can ship it for about 1250 uh, or close to like, 1287 or something like that so i'll definitely do a refund because i'm saving somebody like you know 45 bucks so why not now when there's a situation that i have only a couple dollar difference no i will not bother refining somebody you know if they paid 15 dollars and it cost me 12 i'm not going to refund three dollars but in a situation like this on multiple order that there's significant money to be saved for sure yeah i'll do the refund matter of fact I have another package going out. Uh, the guy bought 12 of these medical cases and we have normally $10 shipping on every one of them. And if he would buy, you know, he bought all 12, the shipping is $120. Yes, it is going in the middle of nowhere to PO box in Wyoming. Still, the shipping is only 56 bucks, but not 120. So I'm gonna refund the difference, you know, so. Trading Post, how can I help you? Yes, it is. How can I help you? Good, Tony. How are you? I'm going to be in here till about 5 o'clock. Okay, sounds good. All right, thanks. Bye bye. My father in law. He was a Molson rep for a long time. This is actually the original box for this. Oh, okay, Two nice, days. yeah. It's one of those, uh, one of those things where it's got the, the little. You know, oh, fuzzy, the, the little fuzzy hairs that they light up. Yeah. Mind if I plug it in really yeah, quick? Go ahead. It's been in my basement for years. Oh, I see. Okay. Be cool. Yeah. So most of this stuff is from like the late seventies, early eighties. Yeah, it's got little like a musty smell. So obviously it's been in the basement or something for a while. Yeah, it's been in the barn. Long time. Is there a little switch on there? Oh, it yeah. went out. Okay. Got a probably little fluorescent bulb in there. Okay. These are kind of like stained glass Molson signs. Two of those. All the same. Those yep. Okay. And then there's this Molson mirror sign. Alright. Yeah, like a coat hanger or something? Yeah. yeah. It looks that way, right? Coat hanger. Yeah. For the bar. Okay. Oh, these are just little like a two back here handle on them. Right, okay. I think there's two of those, and then I've got a set of Oktoberfest brand new glasses, like a box of eight or twelve of them, and then these are just individual little okay. glasses. On that them. I would actually pass. The okay. glasses, I don't, do that. I don't need that. I mean, what are you thinking? What do you want to get out of this? Molson, it's not like a super, you know, following brand. I mean, right. Uh, same thing with, you know, 
Yeah, you know, they're moving like old school. Kind Do of more, stuff. but they're they're older, so yeah. um, they're definitely older. And then that thing's kind of cool. Yeah. I mean, what are you thinking? What do you what do you want to get out of this? Um. Think about it one second. I think I have one more thing. It's like a. Uh, I think I brought it with me. It's in a box, never used. It's a. I think it's Carling Black label, like a table lamp. That's all. It's really weird. I gotta bring it in. Yeah, check, I'll, check, it. I'll check it out. Yeah. It's at home. Oh, it's yeah. at home. Yeah, and that one's. I can't it in the garage. Because that one never been taken out of the box. I've seen it on eBay. It's kind of cool. Um, I'd like to check it out. So next time you win, you know, bring it in. But so, what do you think for this? The, the ten percent of glass. I'm yeah, gonna pass. Um, you know, basically looking at what's on eBay and going under half of that price for all of them with a hundred bucks. I don't think I can do that. And I tell you why. These. So now some, they're gonna be here for a while before I found a buyer. And this is something that I'm gonna put out here for 15 bucks a piece. Yeah. You know what I mean? Okay. When somebody gives me 12, 10 dollars, boom, it's sold, it's gone. Yeah. Um, the most money is in these two signs and mainly in this one because it's just cool the way it lights up. Right, right. Um, I'll be honest, you got like 50 bucks from me here. And then the most money, like I said, I'm saying this is kind of peanuts, you know? Yeah, you know. So it's totally up to you, my friend. If, if you can do 50, I'll do 50. Otherwise, I, I, I would have to pass. All right. Um, tell you what, why don't I leave these here with you for half an hour, hour. I'm going to go get the other thing. Okay. And maybe that'll, not maybe. Yeah, that'll I mean, I'd like to check it out, you know. I think it's worth looking at. Okay. Uh, and I don't want to take them back to my basement. So I think, All right, no problem. I think we can make it work. Let me just okay. try and sweeten it up a little for you. All right. All right. So I'll, I'll set it aside. I'll be here. Peter, pleasure. Peter, yep. thanks. Trading Pulse, how can I help you? We can, depends what it is. What is it? What brand? Is it a singer or? I see, I see. So I know what you have. I have two of those like right now. So I'm gonna have to say no. It's supply and demand and I had him here for a long time. So I'm sorry, yeah. Okay. No problem. Thank you. Bye bye. Um, so the old style one, I'd offer five bucks on. I'm gonna pass on the days gone. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Are you paying for something? For that turntable. Oh. Okay. So one ten is good, right? Yep. Okay. I had to finish looking at your stuff. <laughs> Oh, she's fixing things today. Ruby. Uh, the autograph on that one. I'm going to add a day, a day or two to what I'm doing because they, they cut the hours back. The hotel. And there's nothing you can do. Yeah. I mean, you Take your copy and just grab it on the way out, my okay. friend. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. All right. So you brought it, huh? Yeah. Peter. 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 All right. Let's see. Let's um, check her out. Hey, Ruby. You can set it right up here. Hey, honey. Kitty. Upside down. Yeah, we go. Let's turn it yeah. down. Some kind of bracket here. Maybe for hanging or something? Yeah. No, it's a standing lamp. Why would they stick that in? I think yeah. you could do it either way. Maybe. Probably. Black label. 
a large beer. It's plastic, right? Yeah, that's yeah. plastic. So it looks like it's never been really put no. out out of the box, right? No. Look at that. What a beauty. What a beauty. <laughs> <laughs> So here you got like extra 20 bucks. Not a whole lot of money here again too. So between everything else like 70 bucks, you know, 50 and 20. 75 for everything. That's fine. I'm not gonna have you walk out over <laughs> five bucks. Yeah, that's good. Cool. Okay. I might have a couple other um, like neon signs. Are those interesting? For sure. Yeah. Actually, those I don't. Those are better ones probably too. I don't have any neon signs signs at all right now. So actually, I could use some. Okay. okay. So um, I've got one. One is a. It says hams on tap. Okay. And the other one was the is Molson. The mm, okay. Brand new. I'm gonna tell you something right now. Okay. So so Molson. Molson. Yeah. Hardly any money in it. Oh yeah. But the one that you mentioned right before, hams, hams, could be big money. Yeah. And I mean big money. I would like to see it, make sure everything is good on it, it's nice and clean. Because hams tend to bring some decent money depending what it is. Hmm. So you might have a real gem there, it's very hard to find if it's an older one. Okay. So I would really like to see that. You know, I like I told you, you know, the Molson stuff, it's... I mean, it's for guys that are doing the man cave and they just want a variety of variety stuff. Variety of stuff, yeah, but it's it's but not it's a bud, it's not a Miller, it's not a big it's brand that, you know, I can offer you 15 bucks on it. I got you. you yeah, so. Okay. All right. All right, I'll need um, your idea, I'll write you up for this. And then anytime, you know, you have a minute, bring that in, I would love to check that out, you know? Yeah, yeah, I've got all the other ones in Old Star one. Old Star is good too. I mean, they? it's not. I mean, we just, did you just bought that old style? Uh, go, no? I was going to. Okay. Yeah, I mean, like a simple signs right. like that, not yeah, yeah. a whole lot of money too. But, but the if neon. they're light up neon, yeah, different ball game. Okay. So, you autograph at the bottom. Mm -hmm. The hands like might be a few hundred bucks or more. You know, it could be. Okay. It if could it's be in good shape. I, I gotta Depends look at what it, it is. It 20, 40, 60, 75. Okay. Mm. Yeah, I mean, it's all about the condition on them, how big, okay. how many colors, you know. Gotcha. So, would you yeah. even be interested in the old Molson one or not really? Probably not, since okay. you gave me already a lot of those, right? You know, right. so. So, the hams in the old style you'd want to look at. Yeah, for sure. Okay. okay. All right, Peter, thank awesome. you. Thank you. What do you guys have here? I'm going to flip this around. You're going to be on a video. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> what do you got there, buddy? What is it? It's a son One of a lifetime. Creative images. OK. That's a cool picture. So what else we got? Is that um, yours too? I already looked at that. Yeah? Do we want this? Who's it made? RCA. RCA. I think we got two or three bars. I didn't see them. Where are they? There's one right up front, up there, in front of the TV, okay. and there's two more on the side. So okay. And I'm going to pass on this. Yeah, I think the bars, we haven't been selling bars really good at all, so i got to okay. say no on that. I have no idea on this guy. <sighs> I'm gonna help them. We're doing five and fifteen. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna get these, please. The picture probably just like five bucks. So that's, that's up to him. It's no, so it's your call, buddy. <laughs> what do you think? It's five enough? Sure. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. So we're doing old style. You said what? Five and fifteen. Five and fifteen for the fire truck. Okay. And five for another one. Alright. You're all set? Right Thanks very much. So this was your picture? Yes. Okay. So here's five bucks. 
Yeah. That was yours too? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. I didn't see that. I thought it was his, no? No, it's not mine. No, okay. He, at least he's honest. Well, there you go. What about the other ten dollars? Who I'm gonna give that to? This was fifteen, and uh, he should have got twenty, and I get five. Ah, so we gotta do this the other way around. All right, let me have that back. So you're gonna get twenty bucks because this was fifteen, this was five, and then your dad is getting five. And then this I'm picking up on the way out. And this is going back with you. Yes. Okay. Thanks, We're guys. Go Thank do you so some much. Shopping. All right. Did you take the bell off, Pete? Uh, so I'm tired of putting the bells on. <laughs> Because, because yesterday she that completely bird is messing with their cat. She completely <laughs> cut it in half yesterday her uh, her collar, and then took the bell off. And I grabbed the bell from her and I put her on a new collar. And ten minutes later she took the bell off again from a new collar. Now you guys are not playing. Come on. Yeah, let's box. Let's box. <laughs> Guys, let's go. The clock one is hilarious.